Hello, this is Vertical Sandwich, and welcome back to Let's 100% Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Uh, and I know I got cut off abruptly last time, so uh, if you listen to that one, thanks for listening, watching, and uh, take care. Uh, I actually left the kind of awkward cut in there because uh, I'm in love with my own imperfection. By the way, there was a big edit there in the uh, middle of that pause screen because I think originally it was paused for a bathroom break I had taken, so I, uh, which I wouldn't recommend. I would never recommend that you leave your, your game uh, dirt right before level 12, a paramedic mission, unless you have to, but, uh, I tried to try to leave as much, I, I tried to leave enough up to so you could get a good look at the pause screen and see where the people had spawned and stuff, um, which, again, this was a really good spawn, I got a decent amount of time for each patient, which is 48 seconds, and nobody was in crazy places, although I did almost flip over hitting the, the fire hydrant. So anyway, uh, um, again, uh, welcome back, we're, uh, we're now 11 pickups away. We just picked somebody up, so we're 11 pickups away from being free from this mission forever. And actually, this is going to be shorter, I think, than the last video. So, uh, it's good stuff. Um, let's see. There was something I wanted to say. There was something I wanted to say that carried over from the last video, and I don't remember what it was. Um, but, uh, you know, you, you, you know it would have had to have started raining. Um, which, you know, uh, rain during the paramedic missions, um, it affects your handling. It affects... Um, you're stopping and you're turning, uh, especially on the concrete, maybe not so much on the beach. Uh, but uh, I would suggest, you know, giving people a wider berth and, um, you know, being more careful when it's raining. Uh, slow down if you can. Um, can't, well, I guess cross your fingers and pray. Um, <clears throat> so, um, yeah, here we are. Uh, I'm surprised it's been a long voyage. You've actually, if you've stuck with me, if you skipped this video, uh, you know, bless you anyway. It's, I don't blame you for not wanting to watch the, it's going to be eight videos, the other six videos of this. Um, if you didn't skip, um, it's been fun. Uh, <laughs> glad you, I'm glad you stuck around. Uh, you know, it's, it's, I don't know, there, there definitely is a, I, I, don't get me wrong, there's a sense of self-satisfaction for having pulled this off on, you know, on, you know, with my capture card running, um, because, you know, there's a big difference between knowing that I'm capable of doing this and actually, you know, running a video capture device and proving it. So, um, at the very least I've done that. I've proven that I can do 12 levels of paramedic missions, and hopefully I've proven that you can too. I mean, again, I'm not, you know, you're gonna watch stuff in these videos, because I try to leave in the stuff I do wrong, um, as much as is possible. I'm not gonna post, um, I'm not going to post my other run, because uh, my, my first run at this, I think, lasted 13 minutes. I'm not going to make you watch a 13-minute video of me messing up. Uh, although I might cut out the part where I flip it and get out and it burst into flames. Um, I may splice that in, uh, maybe to something later. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll end up putting together some sort of failure montage or something. I don't know. Uh, but I try to leave in where I, you know, where I don't do things right, kind of, on, so that people do realize that this is not... Nothing I'm going to do in, in these videos, nothing I'm going to do in this game is an impossible thing to do, as, as overwhelming as some of them seem. Um, you know, I'm not a guy who uh, has devoted years of his life to playing Grand Theft Auto Vice City and, you know, has speed run things and holds records and, you know, I'm a guy who has access to the internet who, uh, you know, played, played in his spare time, you know, while, um, you know, working at a grocery store and going to college and things like that. It wasn't... Uh, you know, um, there are games that I'm obsessed with that are that are not this one. Um, the We Love Katamari, I can, can't stop playing that stupid game. <laughs> you know, um, and this game, you know, is genuinely fun. And I, and I think if, you know, I think if 100% completing this game isn't fun for you, you probably shouldn't try to do it. Uh, for me, it was a real blast. I mean, the few things that really, the few things that were painfully annoying, um, and this wasn't, surprisingly, wasn't one of them. Um, things like the boat missions for me, and uh, the, like I said, the second Diaz mission, which is going to be really painful for me. Uh, and uh, some of the later missions, and the rifle range, um, those things, um, those things were a small price to pay for kind of the, all the, all the other fun I had. Um, trashing and blowing up things and stealing tanks and uh, this game really, you know, if you don't think it's funny every time Tommy Versetti calls a cop a cocksucker or every time he just says, you know, you're dead, you're all dead, um, 
you know, if that doesn't make you giggle, um, I don't, you know, uh, maybe a casual play of this game is just what you need to do. Um, I am personally cursed with, I'm, I'm one of those people that has a hard time not 100%ing games unless it's impossible. There are, um, a few, uh, that I, no matter how much I worked at it, I couldn't do it, but, uh, you know, I genuinely, if I don't have fun playing a game, I don't play it. Uh, and this game, I, you know, uh, this game, I, 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 I love every tiring, kind of pointlessly repetitive, frustrating moment of it. Um, you know, I love flying around in helicopters and doing dumb stuff. And, uh, you know, I love killing random people with the sniper rifle. And, uh, you know, it's a, it's a fun game to... It's a fun game to pop in on a day when you're just angry and just shoot people, you know what I mean? It's, uh, it's one of the few outlets in your life where you can. Uh, you know, obviously it's far healthier to, uh, to do that in a video game than it is to climb a bell tower. Um, you know, I love this game for that. I love this game for its kind of endless outlet for aggression. You can just, you know, spend a, an hour playing this game just stealing cars and trying to wreck them in interesting ways, or... Um, you know, that stuff's, that stuff's wonderful to me. Um, I know I'm not saying anything about the ambulance missions at this point. I'm kind of talked out about the ambulance missions, you know. Um, like I said, read the fact sheet. Um, watch other videos of people doing this. Um, you know, you can find, uh, you know, since this is considered one of the hardest things to do in the game, you can find a lot of, a lot of videos of people doing this stupid stuff. Uh, you know, I probably wouldn't have posted another one if I if I didn't think it was a notable achievement, uh, especially in this gameplay. I mean, if I'm gonna post, you know, if I'm gonna post me completing an RC mission, I should probably post myself completing this. Um, and uh, you know, and at least posting the whole run leaves no doubt that I did it. Um, somebody can't say that I somehow, you know, hacked something or did something. And, uh, so yeah, so. Um, enough ranting and raving about how great I think this game is. Uh, although it is, this is one of my favorite games, I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't. Because uh, this is a labor of love, I, I spend ten times as much time processing and editing each video and posting, uh, or uploading, than, than the actual length of the video. So, for every ten minutes you watch, I spend almost, you know, two hours. Which is kind of sad. Um, <laughs> the, uh... And this is actually, it's funny, this is the only spot in the entire run of the game of anybody even anywhere near Starfish Island. And obviously they can't be on there, we can't get in there. Um, but that's another, it's another spawn point that I was not aware existed until I saw in this level. It was, uh, you know, and, and in general, again, like I said, luck is going to be a part of your run when you do this, um, you know, and you complete it. Uh, and please, if you're trying to complete it, complete it. And, you, know, uh, you know, just um, play it until you get it right. It's uh, it's worth it. It's uh, again, I don't like. I'm just the kind of person that I don't like to think that I can't do something. I don't like to admit that something is impossible for me, uh, unless it's impossible for everybody. I'm perfectly fine with the idea that I don't. You know, I'm not going to invent perpetual motion. Um, because, you know, whatever. But, um, I'm not okay with, I'm not okay with watching other people 100% complete a game, uh, and I can't. So, um, you know, so if you're trying to do this, um, and probably not a lot of people are, I mean, this game's nine years old now, I'm kind of, this is almost, this is vintage gaming at this point. Um, but if you're trying to do this, um, or just discovering this game, you know, I mean, judge on your own merits. If you think you can have fun doing this and you really think the benefits are worth it, yeah. um, you know, it can be done. It can be done by somebody, you know. Oh, there we go, we're done. Oh my god, we're done! That's so great! We got these $62,000 now and we'll never get tired. And look at me, oh my god. Take that, ambulance! It's funny, it actually took me a bit to crash it. Like, it took me several tries to roll it and stuff. And then, now watch this, this is crazy. The thing won't explode. It does this. Like, I was waiting for it, I was like, oh, it's gonna explode, and like, look at the crazy thing this thing's doing, it still doesn't want to die. It's like, we've got the, we've got the, like, the ambulance can't get tired now. I waited for it, too, and then I was like, well, nuts to this, we're gonna shoot it. So, 
Here we go. Fire in our ambulance. Yes. Take that. That ambulance took a lot of punishment for what we put it through. I think it's great. Uh, wow, wow, wow. All right, so that's it. We're, we'll never get tired, and we're done with the ambulance missions. And uh, so now I'm going to run up. There's a property right behind the lawyer's office, or right across from the lawyer's office. It has a garage, and uh, I'm gonna run up there, and I'm gonna buy it, and then I'm gonna save the game. And uh, like I said, you'll never see me get in another ambulance unless it happens to be the one convenient vehicle I can get away from the cops in. Uh, yeah, because we're done with ambulance missions. So here we go. Property acquired. Ba bam. Thank you so much. Um, it's always a pleasure. Thanks for tuning in, and. Uh, you take care.